part 1 hello to all the wonderful orbians so children i hope all of you are doing great and i also hope all of you are enjoying the videos watching the videos that we make a few things that i would like to talk to you about before we start today's session first thing is that children i hope all of you are eating food on your own and not asking your mama and daddy to feed you you all are big children you all should be able to eat your food on your own the second most important thing is i hope you're not sitting in front of the television and eating when you're eating you should sit on your dining table with a table mat okay put your plate on the table mat no watching television and no talking when you're eating so i hope you all are doing all this huh that's great now come on let's begin so children we have done story number 12 we finished reading we've also done the prediction of story number 12 in the live class today we are going to do another fun activity what we are going to do is i am going to show you the pictures of story number 12 if i were smaller after that i am going to ask you some questions and i want you to try and answer to all the questions to the person who is assisting you helping you okay shall we begin come on take a look so children are we ready come on let's begin the name of the story is if i were smaller so children i want you to look at this picture carefully okay and my first question is what does the child wish for what does the child wish for as you can see in this picture there is a child sitting on a log and she is wishing for something so can you tell me what the what she is wishing for now moving to the next page what is the butterfly doing in this picture what is the butterfly doing in this picture is the first question and the second question is what is the child's wish what is the child's wish now moving to the next page and the next set of questions first question what are the ants doing here children you can see in this picture there are ants and they are doing something what are the ants doing here and the next question is can you tell me what ants eat so children i want you to answer the questions and i want you to answer all the questions to the person who is assisting you okay so i repeat the question the first question is what are the ants doing and the second question is can you tell me what and eat turning to the next page look at the picture carefully now first question what do you see here what do you see here what do you see in this picture okay second question how does the grasshopper move how does the grasshopper move so children see when we move from one place to another we walk right so when animals and insects also move from one place to another they have different types of walks okay so grasshoppers hop they don't walk they don't crawl they hop okay so grasshopper move by hopping from one place to another now next page can you name this insect i'm sure all of you know the name of this insect come on can you name this insect first question and the second question is what is the child doing here in this picture this girl is doing something so what is she doing right you need to answer the question i want you to look at the next picture carefully and here are the questions first question what are the bees doing as you can see in this picture there are bees right honey bees what are they doing and the second quest question is what is the child doing with them 
there is also a, that girl is there with the honey bees what is she doing what is the child doing with them children i hope you are attempting and answering all the questions good now the next page what do you see in this picture what do you see in this picture where are the fish where are the fish so you need to answer the question where are the fish they are on land they are in the air where are they okay 